I know we've at least once talked about Avatar needing a fighting game. Then it's the argument of how can they make Benders fight when they barely have any physical interaction during combat. I think Ludosity has finally buried the whole game full of zoners argument. I think it's finally time for the Avatar series to get their own fighting game. Ayo hey, guys, your favorite Kage, Enigma Kage, bring you yet another video. If you're new to the channel, welcome. Hope you stick around, watch a few of my videos, and hey, maybe subscribe today. Before we begin, make sure to smash that like button because it greatly helps out the channel in more ways than you guys can imagine. Thank you guys for the continuing support, so let's just jump right on in. So check it, Nickelodeon All-Star Brawl is, well, less than 24 hours away from the filming of this video. Game Mill Entertainment, alongside Ludacity and Fair Play Labs, has brought us three playable Avatar series characters in a fighting game. Yes, Aang, Korra, and Toph make their first fighting game appearance in a platform fighting game not named Avatar. About a year ago, I was working on a project. The project was both a concept video and a small pitch for any developer willing to hear me out and get this fighting game concept on the road. I halted the project for personal issues, but I think I'm going to start it back up again. The sneak peek of my box art is this. But that's not what the video is about. That video will come in the future, but not right now. This video is about Avatar getting a fighting game and that some crazy developer needs to take on this project immediately while the product is getting hot again. The newly Avatar Studios is working on a Kickstarter Avatar role-playing game and that's something to look forward to. The Avatar series is receiving a live-action Netflix film and I believe they are also going to animate some of the light novel content. So we have a lot of Avatar to look forward to in 2022. And the first major update, Avatar-wise, is these characters making their Nick Brawl debut on October 5th, 2021. The way Ludosity has made these characters fight has to spark some kind of interest in a dev team that can take some inspiration and make it their own. I'm not saying we need an Arc System Works Avatar game, but I mean, right now with them turning zoners into fully kitted fighters, I think it's time. It's time to make this fighting game. In the Avatar series, the characters been elements and you rarely see someone take a punch or a kick to the face. However, seeing how Korra and Aang can stay true to their character while still performing physical attacks makes the Avatar fan of me really happy. I know there's some developer that can make this happen. Ludowski, you have cracked the code and I want to give you and Fair Play Labs so much credit, more credit that everybody's trying to give you guys because you make these guys who are supposedly zoners into physical fighters. So, in the comments section below, if the Avatar series were to get a fighting game, would it be better as a 2.5D game similar to Fighters and Strive or an arena fighter game similar to Storm series and Hinokami Chronicles? I really want to know you guys' answer. Let's converse in the comments section below. 